Welcome to the Petty Show with the Bitter Bettys, and we're here to give it a go. If you don't like what you see, that's okay, not everyone has good taste. Jeez, we're petty, we're bitter, we're the Bitter Betty Show. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, we're a little late to this, but I mean, is it, are we really late? Because it's still there. <laughs> uh, there you go. <laughs> Chris Weber. Better late than never, they say. Yeah. Yep. Fashionably uh, late. This is Chris Webby back on my BS. I've seen a lot of reactors react to it. We have, I haven't heard it. I just, it pops up in my feed. And I was like, hmm, we did Chris and, and Ren, and that's the only one that I've heard. Uh, Carol said she's heard a few. Yeah, I've only heard the one, I think. Yeah, just the so, one we did. Yeah. With so, Ren. Figured we would try him again and see how it goes. All right. Yeah. So we're back here. on my bullshit. Back on my BS. I already like that's the title. Uh, I know. <laughs> yeah. I feel like that, that title that's screams me. my name. Right. All right. Y'all ready? Yeah. Yeah. You know, nowadays, people find one thing you said eight, nine, ten years ago. Bring yeah. it back up now and cancel your whole fucking career over it. So let me make it easy for you and just say it all right now. Oh, shit. Uh, my pronouns are fuck you and suck my dick. Unglued, I punch through and bust my clip. I'm a feminist, worst enemy running my lip. Now get back in the kitchen, you fucking uptight bitch. Far as gender roles go, maybe I'm just old. Maybe I'm just sick of women's marches blocking the road. Sick of a culture where a bitch will think looks alone is enough to walk around like the whole world knows them. And in my opinion, ladies, yo, we both got a place in the way that the world works. Since we all were just apes, and when you need us to protect you, men will shoulder the weight. And if he doesn't, he's a pussy, which I know is the case With a lot of these little Gen Z arrogant jerks Who got so many MMR shots, they brains don't work And they've been saying for years that autism's on the rise No shit, it's right in front of our eyes And yeah, I know that I'm an old head now I'm grown and graduated I made it just in time to be considered outdated To a younger generation who didn't grow up Saying Jew jokes and words like faggot when they were playing So now I'm just a bigot for the culture I was raised in Back in the days when Chinese just meant Asian And people were too busy to just sit around Complaining, so why the whole world keep changing? Spread the word. Whippy's back up on that bullshit again. <laughs> Fucking blues, blues. I suggest See? you run and hide. <laughs> and you tell your friends, Whippy's back up on that bullshit again. And this time I think I put Mr. Salt down. Yeah, I'm the generation that I grow up with an iPad So I think it's silly what these kids identify as Still make jokes anytime I see a pride flag Never out of hate, it's just funny to me, my bad Is it a trans man or a cross-dressing man-man Who's physically achieving the things that only a man can Then demand and that I be calling a man And shit is out of hand, but damn trans man I'm just a dumb cis man, but at least I'm trying To fucking understand, but it seems that I've been passed by By the society that I'm in Walking around looking confused at things like Biden, wait, let me not compare myself to a pedophile. Like an Though I do buy coke from his son once in a while. He be putting in his orders to an Al Qaeda supporter who just walks right over the fucking border about a mile. Hunter did the whole pile. I just did a couple bumps, then he bought a couple kids and he threw them in the trunk. Wait, fuck, I am so not down with this kind of stuff. And that's how I kill myself when the Clinton showed up. Yeah, I'ma talk shit oh. in the world gone stupid. Taking off a mech and why the world got boosted. Trying to hold ground while the world's uprooted. Speaking up to the world mutes it. Spread the word. Whippy's back up on that bullshit again. If you're a pussy, I suggest you run and hide. Then go tell your friends. Whippy's back up on that bullshit again. And this time I think I've truly lost my mind. Yeah, I'll put your Ever since I said I'm voting Trump, I've been a bad guy too A group of fans I didn't even know I had to lose And since you're leaving, let me read you one last haiku Yo, guess what? I voted for him last time too But you used to hate Trump <laughs> How dare you change your opinion? How dare you grow as a person? How dare you say something different than the stuff you used to say? How dare you consider switching? I loved you when I agreed, now I hate you just for existing Hate you for this, that, and I hate you for living I'll comment every time you post and I'll say that you're grifting And hate women, you're a racist and a shameful depiction A white privilege, a supremacist, a racist Gives me the villain, oh, it's Basically, so true, he murdered though. the Jews. He dog whistles, gaslights are the words that I use. I don't quite know what they mean, but I heard them on the news. What I'm trying to say is, Webby, fuck you. Fuck you, bitch. I'm still the same, Webby. I'm 
still in Connecticut. I'm still donating every year to save that the gave elephants. Me a little still there. say thank you for your service to the veterans and still fuck your mom every Thursday when I'm in town. I bust that bitch down. Didn't like me then? Well, how you like me now? Cause bitch, I'm a pro. I don't need a pro now. So from right now till I'm in the ground, go and spread the word. Whippies back up on that bullshit again. If you're a pussy, I suggest you run and hide. Then go tell your friends. Whippies back up on that bullshit again. And this time I think I've truly lost my mind. And now I'm back on my bullshit. Whippies back, motherfucker. Forget about it, Frankie. That was fun. I that like was fun, that. But that was, I mean, that he it's said that was true, true shit, man. Mm -hmm. I mean, that that how it be, you know? It's like people will dig up, or they'll they'll just randomly come across some shit you said ten years ago, and then be like, "Yep, like you they, are canceled. You Facebook can no does longer that shit. exist here." Yeah, that's some shit, man. Carol's being quiet. I know. I de I definitely heard some. Uh, like I feel like I heard an Eminem flow in there or whatever. I had uh, a rent flow too. It, but it, I mean, it, I'm not gonna lie. It reminds me of someone else. I mean, Same. Just, that's why I'm not saying anything. <laughs> it does. Uh, I know. I know. I know. I'm not saying yeah. a fucking word. Oh, bleep. Um, because I, 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 I mm. It's, it's, yeah, yeah. But you yeah. know, so, he said it. He's, he can change. No, yeah, so, yeah, no, definitely you change your opinion and stuff. I it definitely let, let like me to me this, this just has a a blueprint about it. Yes. And I, I, yes. So let me say this. <laughs> um do I think that the, the song itself is bad? Absolutely not. Um do I did I like a lot of the punchlines? I sure the hell did. You know, um I didn't dislike the song, but there was a lot of resemblance to me and it just simply could be coincidental, but it just I don't always believe in coincidences, so I'm going to just leave it at that um, and not be negative. Uh, it just, yeah. It, yeah. So um, it was a great either, job. But, yeah. Gr great, great job, Chris. Like, you know, um, and I will, I'm going to leave it at that for as far as yeah. what I'm going to say. Okay. Well, I will say, I thought his flow, his delivery, his cadence, totally on point. I definitely was feeling that. Uh, I think I think overall the message. I mean, uh, you know, even though I I agree with you, Carol, and I know exactly what you're saying. Uh, I the you know it's I'm glad more people are speaking the message, are speaking out against the mm -hmm. dumb shit, and I'll take it where I can get it um, to spread that message as far and wide as humanly possible. So if he was inspired by anyone or right. anything, uh, you know what? I will take it. Good job, Chris Webby. And I, re yep. I really, really, I really enjoyed it. And I think that's the reason why I enjoyed it because it reminded me of some, some something else. Yeah. Yeah. He, uh, yeah. I definitely can hear a lot of his influences, but he definitely has a good delivery for sure. Um, I like his flow. He definitely gives me like, I feel like I can definitely feel the Eminem influence there. Um, a little bit of, you know, I mean, he, yeah. Yeah, it definitely I could hear a little bit of the influence there, but yeah, I think I I actually like this better than the one we heard before. But you know, I like my rap shit, so yeah, yes, well, same, yeah. And the last one he sang a bit more, and I liked it I love a, a good, lot actually. I did like I the last one a song. lot, but as the, and the, and I think the only reason why we really even paid attention to that last one though is because of Fred. But yeah. I was because be, but because of the way he sounded in the last one, I was interested in hearing this one. So yeah, okay, yeah, I'm glad we did. Me too. I really yeah, enjoyed it. Absolutely. Yeah, I would, yeah. I would put yeah. this on my playlist for sure. Yeah. Yep. Spread yeah, that message. Keep Stop speaking it. out, Chris. It, it, yes. Yeah. I, yeah. I hope he does. I hope he does. And we'll definitely probably have to check out some more. Um. So yeah. leave those down in the comments if you guys have any good suggestions. Um. Or Chris, if you see this and you think it's a good one that we should listen to, drop that down for us too. We'll be happy to check it out. Um, and uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you get notified anytime we drop. And then um, if you want to help support the channel, those will be linked below. Um, and then you guys, we are on the road to 5K. That's us. We're trying hard. We're, we're, we're there. We're, we're on that train and we're moving along. So um you know if you're not subscribed please hit that subscribe button and if you are subscribed tell your friends tell your family tell them to come on over to the bitter buddy podcast because we have a lot of fun over here yeah um, we, until next time you guys we even write songs oh. sometimes
Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Peace <laughs> out. Thank you for watching the Bitter Betty Podcast. But before you go, if you plan on leaving some hate, would you rather us be real? Or would you rather us be fake? If you didn't like what you saw, your pennies are probably in the water. Take your fingers, dig them out, put your head between your legs before you pout. This was our Betty show, and we gave it a go. Oh.